Hey guys, today I'm gonna talk about the Tommy Saw from Team Fortress 2. I know, it's an old game, but I love it! No, Team Fortress 2 is gonna die soon! It's gonna end a dead game already! Stop playing that game! But, but I love it! And for the question, is it dead? No, it's definitely not dead. It's not even close being dead. It's probably the way it is. Like, there's still some workers working on it for the update. Like, I've seen the updates. Like, everyone that's still updating in this game. They also nerfed some of the weapon. They also nerfed so many. Like, my favorite gun about the, the shortstop, it used to be like 50, 150 health. But now it's like, became nerfed for some reason. Because, uh, you know, I main scout, so... Hey, we should be talking about the Tommy Saw. It's not really an upgrade or better than the stock of Sasha. It's a side grade for when you need flexibility, firepower at distance. Like, because the fire of the aiming is slow, but however, it has the best accuracy, like for the minigun, which is the Tommy Saw. The Tommy Saw distance damage isn't always useful, though it shines certain in maps. And if your medic is running for the crits, like the crits medic gun, then the Tommy Soft is the way it is to go as basic as a rapid fire, just like a sniper rifle and crits. Like, uh, it's pretty OP, yeah. Enemies can now call out players, so the lack of spin up noise doesn't conceal anything because it's like a silent version of minigun. Like a silent gun, because when you're trying to play as a with a Tommy Slop, it's like you're trying to play as like the sneaky heavy or a spy heavy. Higher damage put out, more forgiving spread is more punishing to the enemy in a larger amount of situation, especially against the flanker spies. This match, I didn't get many kills. At least I got a couple. Now in this scene, I went outside and there's a pyro coming and he wasn't ready. He went to the corner. Well, he wasn't, it was not safe for him. So Tommy Slob, you're still probably going to get killed by a spy, even with a sniper who is pretty good at headshots. And worst of all, the scout, because he's so fast and you have to use the Tommy Slob trying to aim at him, but suddenly he's too fast. He's really fast. And then he always runs! He went the other way! And then he went the other way! It's like hard for me to aim! <laughs> oh, what, you gonna cry? You gonna cry now? You look like death! Oh my god, just whip me already! <laughs> I have no idea why this pyro just like bobs away, YOLO! And it was his apologizer. Like, who the hell uses this apologizer? It's the worst weapon in the pyro! Well, I don't know. Maybe it's good for some players in their opinion. I don't know. Oh, at this scene, I wasn't prepared that this pyro just came and I actually screamed like this. Because ah! <laughs> I forgot to turn down the audio. It's so fast to get the crits. Like, ding, 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 ding. And then I start screaming because it's so loud and scary. It's a heavy. Like I said, you have to play sneaky. And then this is heavy wasn't ready to kill me. <laughs> he knows he had it coming. It's the Tommy Slav. It's so much easy to end burst because you cannot hear a damn spin up for the Tommy Slav. Like it's quiet. It's like a silencer. Like the soldier did not listen to the spin up. He did not know it was coming. So yeah, it is so good when you're like spinning up the Tommy Slav. They don't know. They don't know it's gonna come there because it's so quiet. Like most players, I think, is that they only just. Be alerted if the spin up time is sound is late. If they can hear it, then they are ready. But they're not ready because the time is off. Is quiet, quiet, sticky, sticky, sticky. This scene, I have no idea what is this soldier trying to do. Is he trying to market gardening me with his rocket jump? Like I have no idea what he was doing. Now there's a pyro just exploded himself. Now, now in this scene, there's a medic and a pyro, and stupidly the medic decided not to help the pyro, and then he had it coming. And then this py this medic started using the uber saw trying to kill me. <laughs> like what is these two trying to do? If they had worked together, I would have not be would not win. Like, look at them. In this scene, we managed to, like, push in and then get the cap. Yeah, we managed to, like, kill some of them. It was pretty, pretty good. Like, how the NG is, like, running away from them. And then I decided to go up to check the spies. Because I am so... I was so spy annoyed. Because spies are, like, almost, like, everywhere to me in this game. Now there's a pile. There's this, like, came in and go YOLO. God, there's a heavy trying to kill me! Ah, I'm sorry! Please, don't hurt me! Yeah, to be honest, I am a crybaby. <laughs> I'm sorry, but uh, oh look, there's a medic trying to kill me. It's the same medic, and then that's how I dominated him. 
such a same shame for medic. You should not use an Uber charge. I mean the Uber chain. It's like he's trying to do the Uber chain, Uber chain by himself, like no fans. And then we won. I became the top player of the scoreboard. Uh, I think it is a kind of a fun weapon and I managed to kill the demo man and this heavy I don't know what he was doing. I not I wasn't so sure if he was being a hoovy or not Just because it has a really good accuracy doesn't mean it can like uh, kill someone from far away Just like the medic he managed to like escape just seen I don't even know what this sniper trying to do He's trying to be like heavy with his M SMG gun Submachine gun. The Tommy Slop at the upward. I managed to kill some people in this, and we managed to like win, but then it just went laggy and I just died. <laughs> oh, so I was in an up upwards map, and then this was this happens. I was like, what the heck? Did this guy just like commit suicide not knowing that I actually hit him? Like he just jumped off a cliff. And now this heavy, he thinks he can ambush my team while he did not know I was there to ambush him. So it's like a biggest comeback. <laughs> Continue to go forward and then there's like a scout that just come over there but then he did not know there's a sentry right there and uh, I just pretend I just go relax in the NG nest and for some reason but then I realized there's a sniper over there he's trying to hit shot me and so I was like oh my god oh my god I should go down I just like like get down and then just try to like be careful Good thing I'm not headshotted, good thing I'm not backstabbed, and uh, yeah. For some reason, I realized there's a battle happening to the left, like there's so many people fighting over there. So I decided to like go over there and check it out. And I was like, what is going on? Why is everyone fighting at the left? And then yeah, this always happens. We actually conquered them at the left, and then we, we actually defeated all of them. Except there's a demo man trying to kill me with his sword. Oh my god. Uh... Now, at this scene, we actually conquered them. Several of them killed by me. And then right now, what happened is that this soldier is like fly. I believe I can fly. Yeah, this weapon has been like seven years, and uh, every single like month or year, it has been always keep been changing because the demonstration they've done because this weapon has like attri attributes have changed. Like one second damage and accuracy penalties now applies the first second. And now I I always remember the original Tommy Sop. It was better. I mean I don't know. Beyond those like close range, it's a direct upgrade. That's 20% increased accuracy than neck rates. They're 20% slower fire rates. I like the stylish by the way. It lo looks like a Tommy gun, like a like a mixed up Tommy mini gun. Stylish, more accurate in the silent spin because it's like it's more like a it's related to the Tommy gun gun of course and uh, it's really perfect for ambush because it's like using this gun is like being a spy heavy ninja heavy ninja heavy <laughs> all right best main gun is like describes this perfectly i think but even though i think this and this stock are the best even sasha when there's like when is the heavy update i don't think so i wish like they can actually put more updates on heavy i don't know but uh, with this Tommy Slob, it's like the best weapon of choice in this situation where enemies are keeping for the distance. And like people are like, is this good? At some of my like, some of you may think like this weapon could be updated. New videos about heavy weapons, but heavy updates must be coming soon. Uh, but sadly, that's probably because the exact opposite there is no reason to make a weapon demonstration video if the weapon stats is gonna be changed which means heavy update is gonna not gonna happening not happening anytime soon like uh, one one guy told me when he was playing he was new in team fortress 2 and he got himself a tomisov he always think that there's something wrong with the computer because the tomisov is not making a noise well it's not supposed to make a noise because it's like a, you're trying to make, become a ninja heavy with a Tommy Slop. This video is gonna end soon. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I don't care if you dislike or like or and I don't know. I don't know. I just hope that this gets a lot of views. That's all I care. Thank you for watching and have a great day. I love you all if you're my fans. Thanks for watching guys.